We're having a great time here on the Fond du Lac Reservation at Kiwi's Campground. It's our fifth annual language camp. It's not an immersion camp. We have uh, speakers of all levels. Some people don't know it at all, and others are quite fluent, and everyone is welcome. Uh, I wouldn't say it if it wasn't true. What should they bring or not bring? Uh, well, we don't have any drugs or alcohol. That's a good one. Um, bring, bring some food to donate. Bring some food to donate because you're just sharing with your friends. Mm -hmm. And what can they expect? What can they expect? It's, well, as you can see, looking around here, all of these different hooches have some different art involved is, with them. Is that a, is that a marine term? Huh? Hooch? Hooch, is that a marine term? Yeah, or it's a marine term. <laughs> I was uh, like, I didn't, maybe that would keep... This is right? Waganoganun, quick. Waganoganun is the name for these structures. You see, they, they just uh, close, uh, you know, close it off on the end with bent holes like this, tied together. And as you can see, they're quite spacious. And cool. It feels cool, and it feels I feel a little like a cocoon. Yeah. And there's teaching that goes on in here of different uh, dis disciplines or arts or yes. or uh, of all different sorts. I I teach what I know about making birch bark baskets, and so I've got some people who are uh, they haven't made anything with their hands, so it's kind of a learning experience for them. But we take all, once again, everyone is welcome, all skill levels. Mm -hmm. Jim McGwitch, thank you. Mm -hmm.